Uh-huh. Today we have prepared a very special soup. Nattukoli rasam. Literally translated village chicken soup. A South Indian concoction which is said to increase and strengthen immunity. Garnished with a strong semi-succulent perennial herb. Karpura Valli Commonly known as Indian borage, country borage, French or Spanish thyme, Cuban oregano, Mexican mint or simply soup mint. Come, let's go and have a look at how we actually prepare this awesome tasting soup. Let's first look at the main ingredients. For this recipe, we shall use about 600 grams of village chicken which we can easily identify by its lean texture. Here we are using about half a village chicken, skin on with its feet, liver, heart and gizzard. A cup full of the Karpuravalli herbs, commonly known as soup mint. Quarter teaspoon heaped turmeric powder. Two or three sprigs of uh, fresh curry leaves. One tablespoon heaped coriander seeds. One tablespoon heaped black peppercorns. And one teaspoon heaped cumin seeds. Roasted mildly and mixed together. One dried bay leaf. About three grams of cinnamon sticks. Three star anise. 5 cloves, 3 pots of green cardamoms, thumb sized ginger root sliced and lightly pounded, a handful of Thai shallots lightly pounded, and about 5 garlic cloves lightly crushed, 2 carrots skin removed and chopped like so. and a handful of cherry tomatoes. Let us throw the lightly roasted spices into a grinding mill. Pulse a few times so that we get a consistency something like this. Just a rough powder like consistency. Into a large saucepan, pour in about 2 to 3 tablespoons of your favorite cooking oil. Here we are using virgin sesame seed oil. Keep the stove on medium heat and throw in 1 teaspoon heaped salt. Let us throw in all the whole spices. Star anise cloves, cinnamon sticks, green cardamom followed by the bay leaf. Stir in and temper all the ingredients until the whole kitchen is filled with the aroma of the spices. Let's add in the curry leaves now. Stir in the lightly pounded ginger slices. Let us add in the lightly pounded Thai shallots. Stir and mix it in with the other ingredients. Followed by the lightly crushed garlic cloves. Let us stir and mix all these ingredients together so that they get coated nicely by the hot oil and the salt. Now we shall add in the spice powder which we milled earlier. Quickly add in about quarter cup of mineral water. Stir and mix evenly.
Till half the water we poured in evaporates and the oil starts to separate out. Keep ready the chicken, cut into manageable bite-sized pieces. When the oil separates, we can throw in all the chicken pieces. Stir in the chicken pieces and mix evenly. Simmer covered for about 3 minutes. Once the 3 minutes is up and the ingredients have nicely released their juices, we shall add the carrot pieces. Add about one and a half liters of mineral water. Cook covered until the soup comes to a swelling boil. Like so. Let's give a good mix and turn all the ingredients. Let us now stir in the turmeric powder. Simmer covered and wait for the soup to come to a boil again. Let us now do a taste test. We shall now add in the cherry tomatoes in whole pieces. This way we will get an awesome sensation when we bite into it and they burst in our mouth. The soup is ready. Let us garnish it with a generous amount of the Mexican mint or Karpura Valley. We shall use this soup mint as whole leaves. These herbs come with a rough hairy texture and are not easily digestible. Once the herbs have released the minty oregano type flavor and aroma, we can pick and discard them while enjoying the soup. Let us cover the soup to seal in the flavors and the aroma. The strong and awesome tasting village chicken soup or Natakoli Rasam which is said to be an immunity booster is ready. You should try it out.